So in this video, we've got a graph of an OGIV to the right, represents the cumulative frequency distribution for SAT scores of students in a recent year. The question is, what score represents the 80th percentile? So to me, when I look at this graph, the 80th percentile, over here, that's the 80th percentile. So I go and I see what score hits that 80th percentile. And just looking at it, it looks like a score somewhere in this range. Now it's gonna be easier for you to tell um, when you're doing your assignments, but that score looks like it's about like a 1250, okay? So how do I interpret percentile? If you score in the 80th percentile, what does that mean? That means that you score better than 80% of the people who took this SAT class, or that test, okay? So you beat out 80% of the people who took the test. Now there were 20% that scored higher than you, if you're the 80th percentile, but you beat out 80% of the people who took it. So approximately 80% of the students had an SAT score of 1250 or less, okay? So 1250 or less, so, so that score of 1250, you beat out 80% of the students, okay? The higher percentile, the better the score. You get into that 100 percentile range, you're beating basically everybody in that perfect 1600 score. As you can see, you start getting into the 90 percentile, you're, you're well in that range. A lot of people in that 90 percentile are already scored in that 1500s range, okay?